the Kitchenasium. Today we are making a Christmas tree out of cupcakes. You might have seen the other video that I did where I made a flower bouquet for Mother's Day from Ro from Nerdy Nummies and this one she made too and I thought it was so cool and I wanted to make it. It's so cool the thought of making cupcakes and putting them on a styrofoam kind of tree shaped cone thing. Kind of like an ice cream cone. Maybe like a baseball bat, but I'm not sure what those look like. I've just baked some cupcakes and I've used a peppermint cupcake liner, but you can use whatever cupcake liner you would like if it's green or something. You don't really see it too much until you get to like the top, but I like the peppermint look, the red and green Christmas. And you want to make sure you use green frosting because the Christmas tree is green, or maybe you could swirl like in some white. Then it would kind of be like a frosted with snow Christmas tree. That would have actually been cool. So I'm just going to pipe on some swirls like this. And the tip I'm using is 109. So. I'm going to start by putting on the toothpicks. And I think I'm going to have it where I want to put on a cupcake that I've made right in this toothpick and then put on the other toothpicks where I want it to look after I put on each cupcake. That's found smart in my opinion. Ro said to start from the bottom and work to the top, so I'm just going to start by putting this first cupcake on. That is super cool. So now I'm going to put the toothpick right next to it. And if you wanted, you could leave a little space because we are going to put these cute little candies. They're circular shaped, so they'll be really cool to look like ornaments around our tree. Or you could also use like peppermints. Super cool. And remember, it's okay if there's some space because we're going to fill it with fun candies. Looks so cool! And I love the peppermint look because I like the red and green. Very Christmassy. And now I'm going to put my final cupcake on top of the tree. Ta-da! It looks so cool. But as you can see, there are a few spaces missing. So we're going to fill it with candy and peppermints. So I have just taken some frosting and a smaller tip. This is tip 21 and I'm just going to start by taking some candies. Now Ro in her videos put a big star on top but I'm going to put a gingerbread on top. Oh it smells so good. So I'm just gonna hope for the best and stab it into the cake. It's working. Okay, sorry, I was like, I'm excited. Yay! So this is so much fun. So perfect for your holiday parties. They're so cute and we have a Christmas tree and all kinds of candy ornaments all over it. This tree turned out so great. It looks so cool, so great for your holiday parties. And if you want to see Rose make this, you could probably go on the cooking channel and watch Ro's Tasty Treats. It's such a great show and I love Ro from Nerdy Nummies so it's great to see her on the cooking channel. It was really great and so cool to watch her make her own Christmas tree. So thanks for watching this episode of Kitchenasium. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook and subscribe, comment, and like down below. See you next time. Bye!